Hello everyone, I am Sean the Burn Scammer, and uh, the reason why I'm not using face cam for this, I apologize dearly, but the reason why I'm doing this it, without my face cam in is because otherwise it says high encoding, uh, too much GPU usage, blah blah blah. Anyway, so I actually have this game for you, it's called Goedin's Attack on Titan Fan Game. It's a really cool game, and I'm going to show you guys something that's really, really cool about it. I'm just going to go with the tutorial, why not? Uh, and we're just gonna go ahead and play this. It's gonna be a lot of fun. I'm not actually gonna do the tutorial because I've done it plenty of times. But, there was a legend. Not really, but I'm making this up so it's not boring. There was a legend about if you go beyond these walls. Oh my god. Those city buildings are not there for me. Anyway, I have actually discovered this one. I'm like, wait a minute. Sorry, I don't know if, it's just, I don't know if you can hear me. And just to make sure that you guys can hear me, I just turn off the music. Wow, I am definitely not as good at this game as I am with the music on. It makes me feel, oh god, what's happening? Oh god, help! Uh, okay, no, nope, I'm stuck. Okay, here we go. This game is really fun! I'm just, like, in love with it. I know I'm saying that a lot. That's the uh, three reasons one, because for the second of all, I know I don't talk about it. But, uh, yeah, just go ahead, get this game, check it out. It, I almost guarantee you'll have a good time once you learn the controls. They can be a little bit difficult to get used at first. But once you learn the controls, uh, and master them, 
can bas you can basically be a master at this entire game because that's really what this game is. I'm pretty much a master at the uh, OBM gear. That is not what it's called. Uh, the omnidirectional dir movement gear. Uh, that's omnidirectional omnidirectional mobility gear. That's what it's called. <laughs> Sorry, I'm tired. Uh, but I've actually been watching a lot. Oh wait, no. Uh, what I actually triggered me to play this is um, I've been watching a lot of Attack on Titan recently because I mean the show's awesome. I used to watch it a lot, but then I'm but after we moved, I uh, I haven't actually watched it in this house. But then I'm like, oh wait, I should probably watch that, so I decided to watch it. And then I was just playing the um, now I'm playing the internet game, and then I'm like, oh wait. Gideon, or Gideon, Gideon, like that, I don't know how to match name, but, uh, he made a fan game, and it's really cool, I, so I should probably check that out, and so I did, and I'm like, oh yeah, I remember this game, this game's really fun, and so I decided to play it again, and I made it myself right, it really is, so, uh, yeah, this game's just really fun, I'm still learning the controls, uh, this game is really worth playing. In fact, most of the time, I'm normally uh, doing some races, so the tutorial pop-ups aren't there. Uh, but, I play this a lot, and I go over to that castle there. That's because, uh, that's uh, probably the best place to do this. I'm actually going to go over there so that I can show you some of that stuff. So that's divity sticity stuff. This game is not completed. In fact, uh, you should probably uh, get back to work on this game because this game needs to be completed because this game is so fun. And I can't wait till this game is completed and he puts in an actual Titan. Because it's really fun. Right now you just have those uh, little pop-up ones uh, that you see in the show for training. But, I mean, those are really cool, but I can't wait to get into real Titans and get into the real world instead of being in this place. I mean, this place is fine. I mean, uh, I'm having a lot of fun being in here already, but I can't wait to see what the actual, you know, town is going to be like. And, uh, the actual town with the Titans. It's going to be really cool. And I, this game has so much potential, mainly because it's fun already. But once he completes this, this game, game is going to be phenomenal. This feels like a game that would be on Steam, actually, but, uh, this game is actually on Game Jolt. I'll leave a, uh link in the description for it. It's really fun, really cool, and I absolutely adore this game. Now, I don't know if anyone has actually figured out uh, how it's, I don't know if anyone has actually figured out uh, to go beyond the walls and have unlimited play, place storage uh, beneath the floor. I don't know if anyone has figured that out already, but I learned it on my own, and I decided I don't think anyone's made a video about that, so I'm gonna, so I'm gonna make a video. And if people have made a video on it already, well then dang it. Also, it's probably going to get uploaded late. Right now, it is, hold on, it's 11.44 a.m. Uh, the 28th of August right now. So, uh, yeah, if someone's made a video after that time, then yay, I'm the first to figure it out. Or at least the first to make a video on it. But, but if somebody makes it after, before this gets uploaded, well then... Not the first uh, to upload a video like that. Also, by the way, that slow motion isn't lag. That's a, that's the motion is actually you know supposed to do this. It's not there right now. Anyway. Uh, I'm pretty. Sure. Once you play the game, uh, you'll know. It took me a very long while to figure out how to do this. I always went like that, and then went like that. But I figured out the best way to do stuff like that. First of all, to go like that to get speed, but to go like that and then that, and then let go of that one, and then hold W and A, or if you're going the other way, hold W and D, and then if you want to go faster, go like that, keep holding those two buttons, go like that, and then just hold space, let go of that one, it's really fun. And that's just how you gain speed if you're going too slow for your brain. There's the slow motion on. Also, if you're wondering why 
why I always put a bunch of text in there. Uh, I find it, uh, at first I was just capturing, at first I was just capturing stuff that was, you know, that I didn't say, or stuff that I missed. I was just saying it for stuff like that, like stuff that I've missed. Uh, but now I kind of find it as, like, my alter ego speaking back to me. You know how Deadpool has a bunch of voices in there, in his head? Uh, kind of like that. Just, like, someone else that's ju that's still me, but somebody else, like, repeating what needs to be said, or somebody making a bunch of jokes. Stuff like that. Stuff to make my videos funny as well. So, uh, now that's what I, that's uh, what I kind of figured as, um, that... A uh, bunch of text because if you're because it's not just me putting in too much text I actually decided to do stuff like that and make it fun that's why there's like a lot of text not just a little bit of text like uh, some YouTubers do but like in most of my videos there's a bunch of text I don't know if I actually am going to do that in my uh, gaming videos but uh yeah also, since this isn't being at nearly as laggy as uh, how it would be with my webcam, because I'm looking at the recording as well, it's not being nearly as laggy. I mean, it's being more laggy than how the game is running on my computer right now. Right now, it's running pretty perfectly, but uh, it shows lag happening there from lag. But in reality, there's no ha lag happening on my computer. It's all on the recording. Jeez. Come on, like, stop there. We go. It's kept. It keeps saying uh, high CPU usage warning, stuff like that. High encoding, blah blah blah, that kind of crap. I hate it. That's why I'm hoping to get a capture card or just get a better recording system. Because capture cards run in the background of your computer, and that's what my computer is used for. It's a gaming PC, but it can also be a recording PC as long as the recording system go is in the background. That's what the people that made this computer actually say. And I'm like, wait, it's, it's lagging a lot when I use OBS. That's because it doesn't run the background. I had another, uh, I've already told you the story on how I actually have good content on my computer that's not laggy or, or slow or anything. It's actually good content. I have already told you that stuff. At least I believe I did. And that's because that recording stuff there ran in the background of my YouTube. I might actually start recording more content without webcam. Uh, so then it doesn't lag as much and I can actually record more gaming content. That'd be wonderful. Although, all my horror games I'm going to be doing, I'm going to add face games. Because I'm going to be screaming and I'm going to be reacting a lot. And if I don't do that, then that's basically just me and you guys. Because you guys definitely want to see my face. If you want to see my videos at all. But if I make, but you guys definitely want to see my face for uh, horror videos. That was a thing. I mean, I'm not you, but... I think so. I personally just think it makes my videos better in, in general, mainly because uh, it's just not a bunch of boring stuff. And I apologize that I'm not using webcam. I actually tried to make this video before. I mean, without talking, just a test video, of course. Just me dicking around doing stuff. It wasn't actually me talking. But uh, I tried to do that with webcam just to make sure I just would work with webcam. And it lagged way too bad. Even before it even started the recording, tapped it started the recording and it immediately started lagging and giving me that one. But with this, it's actually a lot better. A lot better. So I might start uh, making videos like this. Uh, anyway, so I guess that's really all. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed, then punch that like button. Slap that. Sorry, it's difficult to talk and play this. And it's a little gym after. Okay, I'm gonna stop. Thank you guys so much for watching. Ooh, wait. Now I can switch over to here. Okay. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed, then punch that like button, slap the subscribe button. I'll see you in the next episode. Sorry, I'm looking over here to make sure that's not like. See ya!